Periodic fasting can help clear up the mind and strengthen the body and the spirit. Intermittent fasting is a new approach to dieting and healthy eating with a long history behind it. Recently, it's becoming something more and more people are talking about because of the benefits it appears to bring. Before we jump into said benefits, it is important to mention that every person is different. Before undergoing a new diet or a new practice that can influence your health, it's necessary to talk to a doctor and see what they say. If you try intermittent fasting and don't feel good, stop the practice immediately and check with a medical professional. Having said that, let's see what people are saying about intermittent fasting. Losing weight. For some people, intermittent fasting appears to help with managing their weight. It can be easier to maintain than a diet that is centered on caloric restriction, as most diets are, because it is intermittent, not constant. It can help people reduce their caloric intake, and as a result, help them lose weight and maintain a lower weight as well over time. Losing weight is a complicated process, however, it is clear that it depends on regular habits, rather than one-week or one-month commitments. Finding a consistent way to reduce how much you eat without breaking down can be a great path to maintaining a lower weight. Lower Risk of Diabetes There are two types of diabetes. The one that tends to happen later in life is associated with insulin resistance, a metabolic problem in the body and a predictor for developing said type 2 diabetes. It seems that intermittent fasting can help reduce the risk of insulin resistance, but it's not clear if this is connected to intermittent fasting as a practice or just eating less. Still, it's worth noting that many people find intermittent fasting easier to maintain than the alternative, which is dieting. Better Heart Health Intermittent fasting appears to reduce several problems that can lead to heart issues, such as blood pressure, heart rate, and cholesterol levels. This means that people who practice this can do better in regards to their cardiovascular health and reduce the fat content in their blood. We know that heart problems are related to high levels of specific types of fat and other substances like cholesterol and triglycerides. By fasting, it's possible to lower the level of these substances, which leads to better health overall. People with genetic predisposition towards heart issues should perhaps look into intermittent fasting. Reduced inflammation? Inflammatory processes can happen in different parts of the body and affect the organism as a whole. Inflammation is linked to a variety of problems, from depression to even something as severe as Alzheimer's disease. It seems that intermittent fasting can reduce inflammation and also contribute positively to processes like lower sugar and others that can lead to inflammation. More control over nutrition. Like other dietary practices, intermittent fasting pushes you to be more aware of what you eat, when you eat, and how you eat. This can lead to more mindful diets and more awareness of the food you eat. You're likely to snack less and choose your meals more carefully. On its own, this is a kind of practice that can improve your relationship with food and offer other advantages. You are less likely to just eat for eating's sake or eat because you are bored. It helps you heal. Just as fasting seems to reduce inflammation, it appears to give your body a better chance of healing. It provides the opportunity for your cells to recuperate and seems to facilitate the growth of new cells, which is highly beneficial for your organism as a whole. As it lowers inflammation, your body can just focus on healing and recovering whatever requires this. You can discover that your body copes better with a variety of situations and regenerates faster.